Welcome, welcome to the business reading for the month of January for the Librans. Well, 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 Librans, I am loving, loving, loving your reading. Oh my God, Librans. All right, my darlings. Okay, so what we have here is coming up is that this is for the people on the work floor. This is for the people with business. Now, for the people on the work floor, what I'm seeing is that um, this is truck. This is your own energy vibration. This is you, Librans. You're coming in this month in the first week being very, very strong. Whatever that you were dealing with, whatever issues, whatever obstacles that you were dealing with before you leave for vacation on the work floor, I see this is good. I see you're going to be finding out something about a young um pisces cancer or scorpion i see you're going to be victorious over this person i see that you liberals could have researched something and find out something about a young pisces cancer or a scorpion now whoever this person is i realize that this is as if you had an issue with this person on the work floor you realize that something is a little bit off by this person you went to um, check out and see what was happening. You have information that you found out the secrets of this Pisces cancer or scorpion. This is a young lady between the ages of uh, say 25 and 45. Okay. And she was having a lot of secrets and you're going to be finding this out. Okay. I see that whatever this energy is, is that this energy is that you have defeated whatever that was going on you have defeated whatever the deceptiveness and the cruelty that was going on so in the last week you gotta be careful but you're going to be coming out on top anyway libra and so i see you liberals are really searching through you are really trying to figure out some situation on the work floor and finding out some cruelty that was um, taken place or some deceptive things if you notice your reading liberals there is just so many powerful things that is going to be happening to some of you at work i see whatever is transpired you're going to be defeating the cruelty that people have uh, done to others and you're also going to be balancing out certain things because i see that some of you liberals are coming back to work and finding out something on the work floor some secrets that was kept and the secrets could be about money okay so some of you could be realizing a theft that was um done at work and it has to do with a pisces cancer or a scorpion person you're going to be finding out that this person had so much secret and they've stolen a lot so i see you liberals finding out this thing and seeing the secrets and that someone has deceptively stole money or access someone else's account so i see you liberals really bringing out is as if judgment you're bringing down judgment because you found out something about some situation that was transpiring i see you defeating a very cruel thing that has happened so there was some deceptiveness that was going on against other people or that sort of a thing and i see you liberal stepping in and defeating and decepting this horrible thing now so liberals you're going to be very victorious whether in work or business victory is going to be here for you uh, liberals okay so whatever that has been transpired you liberals are standing your ground and you're going to be victorious uh, over whatever that has transpired what we're seeing here is that some of you whoever this young person is this person could be working for you or it, it could be your pr or your assistant but you found out something about this person Person. and what you found out is not really nice because it has to do with a lot of money some secrets about a lot of money and it has to do with someone who works very close to you or um some investigation but it has to do with a young pisces cancer or or scorpion person okay secrets about their wealth is going to be coming out you're going to be finding out secrets about their wealth some of you in business you're going to be very wealthy whatever is transpiring i see a lot of money is coming in you're going to be very wealthy your business is going to be good then we see some judgment call 
um, where you defeated a situation and you spoke up about something. So it could be on the work floor and it could be if you have a business that you find out some unscrupulous things that was happening and you defeated it. You saw the cruelty. Okay. There is a judgment call because you saw the cruelty of something that was going on. So what is happening is that the nine of swords in business is like some of you could be also worrying about your work because you give up someone you're worried, but there is no need to worry because trust me, um, this is the six of, uh, um, this, the six of this, the six of cups. And that means people are going to be happy with what you have found out. Now we have the magus, the magus in the first week going in the second week on the work floor. And that is it. Yes. Whatever you decide to do in the first week or the second week, it is a yes. Is it at work? Is it in your business? Is a yes. I see that some of you found out the secrets of a Pisces cancer or a scorpion. And, um, if it's not, uh, this is someone who could be, um, working person. It could be your personal assistant, your secretary, whoever this person is, but you found out and whatever the information you found out, it is correct. Okay. Um, it is definitely correct. So whatever you found out is definitely correct about this person and whatever the situation. So expect in the second weeks, you Librans, that, um, things are going to be coming out that you had your guess about. And now the truth is going to be coming out. You had your guess about whether or not something was true. You were right. And, um, the information is coming out. Now, some of you, if you're looking for a job, the second week going in the third week, I see an offer coming up to you. This offer that is coming in is going to be um, like one and a half times the salary you were receiving. Okay, so if you're looking for a job, I see an offer coming up in the in the, in the um, second week going in the third week. It's going to be very unexpected. But um, they're going to be offering you like one and a half time what you were working. OK, they're going to be offering you like maybe twice what you were um, receiving at your other job. So in the, fir the, the um, first, the second week going in the third week, I see an offer is coming up of a new job that is going to um, give you like twice your old salary or one and a half times your old salary in business. I see um, a whole lot of money. So it could be that you made a lot of sales and finally the credit cards or whatever is coming in and um, it's on your account. So I see you in the third week. It's going to be so powerful. The third week is going to be good for you guys at work. It's going to be good for you guys at business because what is transpiring is that unexpected money is going to be coming in. Um, I see people could be offering to buy your company um, in the third week also. All right. So be aware of that or to um, offer you more money to help to build something. So this could be coming up if you have a business in um, the fourth week. Um, in the fourth week, we have um, the six of swords. Now, what is that? That is worries. Okay, the six of swords is worries. So I see some of you ending um, the third week, um, coming in the fourth week with some worries. Okay, um, it's all about, it's all in your head. So let it go. Let it go. It's all in your head. Let it go. Whatever is transpiring, it's not true. Um, whatever you're thinking that you're going to be defeated if you tell the truth about something that is happening. No, it's not going to happen because I see business is uh, business is good. Business is good. Business is going to be picking up. Um, and what is transpiring is that there is too much worries in your head. Let go of this worries because you know, liberals, you need to understand something. You got to let go of uh, whatever that was transpiring because trust me whatever the deceptiveness that is at play you're going to be overcoming this and i see a lot of worries that is here because in the fourth week you guys are like worried worrying about outcomes of something because you give up someone 
don't worry about it because you're going to be they're going to be happy that you come forward some of you were dealing with a young Aries Lee or a Sagittarian person whoever this person is and was and whatever that was happening with this person um, this person is very deceptive is someone on the work floor be aware of this person be aware of this work person this is someone on the work floor be aware of this person this person is uh, not vibrating on a positive energy vibration this person is a colleague um, of you and they're not vibrating on a positive energy vibration so be be aware of what is transpiring around you okay because this person could be creating issues on the work floor for you it is a young man um, this young man is uh, 25 to 45 okay maybe 50 but 25 to 45 or yeah so whoever he or she is they are creating some real deceptiveness for you on the work floor but not to worry because I see you're worried about outcomes and there is no reason to worry about the outcomes because what is transpiring here um don't worry about the outcomes because you're going to be okay whether it's in work whether it's in business the fifth week whatever that has transpired on the work floor that has to do with a young man that is an aries leo or sagittarius i am seeing that you're coming out of the month being very very um instability because this is wonderful because i see some of you or just standing up and moving forward okay it's all about moving forward it's it, there, there is no mission of you turning back at this time Librans okay because whether it's in business I see you're going to be victorious over an issue because there there was definitely an issue that some of you were dealing with a young Pisces cancer or a scorpion and whatever you found out about this person you're right on target you're right on target about this person you were touching the target so you're right on target about this person definitely an offer if you have been looking for a job in the second week going in the third week definitely an offer is coming in um a business offer um for some of you could be coming up also so this is going to be good and as we look there is too much worries because i see you guys people who are working is worried people who are having their business is worried about an outcome so some of you who are worried about the outcome so um you could have applied for something help for your business there is no need to worry about the outcomes because the outcomes is going to be good okay there is just just one thing i just really want to find out this knight of wands because this knight of wands is kind of worried about something all right so some of you are dealing with an aries Lee or a sagittarian person and they're kind of worried about something um or you found out something and they're worried but you gotta be aware um this could be also a business partner if you are in business do not go do not if you meet someone that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius in the fourth week do not get intimate with this person again business people if you meet someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius in the last week of January via via business meeting do not get intimate with this person it is ad advised do not get intimate with this person your first week and second weeks whether in business or on the work floor is going to be good all right let's see what this man is all about okay so there's an end coming to this man this man has done and you are going to be successful over this man okay and expect money to come in so whatever has transpired whatever has transpired my darlings um this man has created some lies and deception <music>